This is a screencast developed to help you and your unit sign up for summer camp on our new reservation system. As you can see, I'm here at the home page for our website, www.cpcbsa.org. From here, you will want to click on the camp that you are planning on going to summer camp for from the camping menu on the top of the page. At this point we will select Camp Merriweather because it will be a good example for several of the options that you will see when you go to make your reservation. On the camp page there are several different things to note. On the right hand side are several camp links for various information that you may find useful for summer camp for year-round. On the bottom of the page you will find links to various camp downloads which will be updated as the season progresses. Currently many of the 2015 items are listed available for your camp. Before you get to the downloads however you will see a section that says Summer Camp Reservations. Here at the Reservation section you can see for Boy Scout Summer Camps we have 2016 and 2017 Summer Camps available for reservation. Be sure to select the proper year when you are making your reservation. For Camp Merriweather you'll see we have eight weeks here available for registration, yet six of them are already full. In order to walk through a registration, I will select week two and click the register today button. In order to make a reservation, you will have to have an account set up for your unit. If you are a member of the Cascade Pacific Council, you already have an account that was created for you. If you are unaware of what your account credentials are, you can contact your district executive or the volunteer service desk and they will be able to help you get your username and password for your unit. It is imperative that if you are a Cascade Pacific Council unit, that you do not create a new account. There is already one for you. If you are a unit from a different council, you will need to create a new account. There are separate screencasts that will walk you through that process that can be found on the website. For our purposes, I will log in with our demo account to demonstrate exactly what the process will look like. As you can see, after I clicked on that button and I logged in, I come to this page, which many people may recognize as familiar. I would then click on the Add Event Registration, making sure that on the top here it says Summer Camp Merryweather. It will give us, again, an option just to make sure that we're choosing the right week, and I would like to go for the second week of Merryweather. After you select your week, it will take you to this page where you it shows you current prices, how much is due up front for the payment in order to make the reservation. You'll want to select the number of youth that you are bringing to camp with you. I have decided to bring 15 youth and two adults with our demo troop here. On the bottom left hand section of this page it shows you what the total registration fees will be for your reservation during the summer. At this point it also tells you how much money is being added to your shopping cart in order to make the reservation currently. And it will tell you after that payment next to new balance here how much money 
is still required to be paid in full by the time camp starts next summer. On the top of the page here, you'll notice that there were two tabs, Registration and Campsite. This is currently the Registration tab. If we click on the Campsite tab, you will be given your choice to select three campsites that you would re be requesting for the summer. These campsites are not guarantees, but just requests based on your preferences. Our camp directors will do whatever they can to fit you into your requests, however they are not guaranteed. Finally, you'll click the Save button. Changes requested have been added to your cart. You would select OK. Up here, we have several options, Home, Profile, Cart, and Orders. When you first came to this page, you started on Home. You can make profile adjustments to your unit account if you hadn't already done so by clicking on the profile. Here you will have contact information for the primary reservation holder. This should most likely be the person within your unit that is going to do the majority of the reservation information for not just summer camp, but for many of your unit events. Also, alternate contacts, which are particularly important for summer camp, so we at least have two points of contact for your reservation. And finally, down here is account information with username and password. If you are a Cascade Pacific Council unit, you may want to update your user and password to something that is more relevant to you. Next is the cart. Here is where we actually complete the transaction. You will notice that this is your order, event payment update for 2016 Merryweather Week 2. Over here it tells you the order amount to make this registration is $150, which is $10 per boy on the reservation. We can copy the profile address from the profile or put a new address in uh, if we are paying by credit card and the address differs from what is on the profile. Credit card payments are the only option that you have in order to make a payment through this website. If you are a unit that must pay by check and have no other option, please leave your registration in the cart. It will stay in the cart so long as you do not click the X right here. You are able to close your browser and do other things with your computer so long as you do not hit that X. That means that it will stay in your cart and you can make a phone call or email to the council office and, call, and talk to the volunteer service desk in order to complete your registration and make your payment. For those that are able to pay by credit card, please enter your relevant credit card information in the boxes right here and click the Submit My Order button to complete the transaction and make your reservation for summer camp. At that point, you've completed making your reservation for summer camp. If you have any further questions about your reservation, you can contact the camping department by email at camping at cpcbsa.org.